I'm going to go for a long rest. Yes. I'm so glad I found... Wait! I'm Althira. A bard from the Grove. I don't mean any harm. I'm Jesse the Good. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I know who you are. How could I not? You're all anyone in the Grove talks about. That's why I'm here. When I'd heard what you'd done, it inspired me. Made me feel brave again. I want to join you. To fight by your side. I want to help people. As you've helped us. Hmm... Are you sure? It's like they're a dangerous life. I've been running since El Terrell. And when we finally arrived at the Grove, we found danger there too. Unless I hide away from the world, I can't avoid it. So I'd rather face it head on. With you. Uh... I don't know if I don't know you or trust you. I don't know that I trust you though. You just showed up in the middle of the night. This outfit, the whole thing's suspicious. The whole thing is weird. It's suspicious. I think you should, I think, I think. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I already have psychopaths in my group. That's the problem. I'm already terrified of, like, I don't want to, everyone in my group, we're all bound together because we have a worm in our head. I don't know this lady. She don't have a worm in her head or else I'd have an option saying that she has a worm in her head. <clears throat> so what I know already from the fact that it didn't trigger is that she's not one of us. And the only reason why we're all getting together is because she, uh, because we have something in common. She doesn't. She's an outsider. I don't know that I trust her. Jesse the Good, here's the thing. Jesse the Good wouldn't put a random stranger in harm's way. Where we're going on a quest for worms, we could turn any minute. We could turn any minute and kill her. But I can fight. I won't hold you back. I swear it. Let her stay if you want. But if that bard breaks out in song, I'm not having it. Please. Oh, please. <clears throat> Ready yourself to attack? I don't want to attack her. That's crazy. My options are like, kill her. <laughs> Wait, can I non-lethal her? <laughs> can I non-lethal her? <laughs> that is so stupid. I don't want, uh, no, Jesse would not say I want to hear you beg. I'll F5, I'll save right here. Fine, you can stay for the night, but I want you gone by morning. All right. Good night, I guess. Look at this outfit. This is cuckoo bananas. The sooner we go to sleep, the sooner I'll get out of your sight. Just 
Leave me be. All right, I'm gonna go to bed. I wanna see what happens. You open your eyes with a lurch, and you are not in your bed. You stand above a body which is in a state of gore nearly beyond recognition. The body of that scared girl who asked for nothing more than a night of shelter. Her blood covers you. No. Nope. Jesse the Good, you, you chat. I gave in to you. you Jesse the Good would it. never. Jesse the Good would never. How dare you? How dare you? You sons of bitches. All of you knew. All of you knew. Jesse the Good would never. He would never. Jesse the Good instead will physically attack this woman and knock her out. Jesse the Good <laughs> will physically attack and brutalize this Jeez. woman rather Jeez. than killing her. I'm gonna go as long as I can without being a killer and having dark urge. You can't, you can't. I saw chat was like, come on, come on, Jesse, come on. You monsters, you all did that to me on purpose. All right, I'm going. God, you really are a bastard, you know that. Sometimes in life you must be a bastard. Nobody made you do anything. My feet can carry me. Good fellow. Quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Uh, has your research turned up anything that might help with this parasite problem? My research turned up a rather brilliant technique that seems quite actionable. It's not too deep. Just behind the orbital socket. I could attempt an extraction. I've a needle in my tunic, after all. I'd rather get a second opinion. <laughs> You won't find a more learned opinion on this matter, I assure you. Um. No, I'm all right. I don't want to get poked in the eye. You only have a matter of days to live. Don't dally, my friend. All right. Jesse the Good. Does not play games like that, my friends. That is for sure. You open your eyes with a lurch, and you are not in your bed. You stand <laughs> in a state of gore Stop. beyond recognition. Stop. The body of there's no winning. There's no win. All right. Well then. Shell. Hold on. Well, if that's the case, load game. If that's the case, I'm going to be as nice to her as possible. I'm going to be the nicest. Jesse the Good is about to be very nice. <laughs> sure, come on, fucking. Come on in. I don't give a fuck. Get in here. Get in here. I love you. Come on, you barty bastard. Get it. Sing me a song. Come on. Come on. Jeez. Oh, please. You can join me. <laughs> then well played, because I was moments away from getting on my knees. Joking aside, thank you. You won't regret this. But I you promise. will. <laughs> oh, no. Well, good night, everybody. Good night. Question. Oh, she can see everything, huh? I just want a little look. I was going to try and pick Parker. 
Wait, hold on, hold on. This calls for careful footwork. Why am I sneaking around? Attention. Free for the taking. Little bit of this, little bit of that. Wait, did I steal her loot? <laughs> what? Oh no, she noticed and ran. <laughs> woman she ran away and she's still gonna die oh wait no What's she's still in camp discussion we're fine she's still here nope she doesn't want to talk to me huh go bother someone else I thought we could be friends breathe deep and move Yeah, all right. This sucks. Wow. No matter what. All right. It was only a matter of time, but here we are. You open your eyes with a lurch, and you are not in your bed. You stand above a body which is in a state of gore nearly beyond recognition. The body of that brave girl who earnestly swore to devote her life to your cause. Her blood covers you, and its warmth feels like the embrace of an old friend. It's even worse because it's multiple you times I've had to watch this. You ended up here, but your head pounds and aches. Oh. Uh, well, my intelligence and investigation suck. But I'll give it a shot. Oh yeah, I'll take her guidance. I'm sure this will be fine. No guidance. I don't know shit. The throbbing in your skull will hardly let you think, let alone remember. Investigate. Something, something help me. Okay, 14 works. There are dozens and dozens of wounds on the corpse. Oh my god. The killer did not stop savaging it, even when she was long gone. And your dominant arm aches. It aches from stabbing over and over. No matter how it appears, the body is there, and her blood is on your hands. The Damn. question flows through your mind. Damn, this is Who the are worst. You really? That you could be guilty of such bitter business. Uh, <clears throat> what curse is in your heart to kill in your sleep? Something wicked must have broken <coughs> you. The contemptible pervert within must have lavished slash after slash upon the girl. But where, oh, where could that monster have come from? If only you knew yourself better. You don't have much time for reflection now. You need to act. You may only have a few moments before the others awaken and begin to cast blame for the hot sin before you. Uh, stealth? Try to hide the body. Oof. Uh, disadvantage. Prepare to face the others. Seek out the nearest water to wash away the blood. You scrub yourself until your hands are cold and raw. While your body starts to feel clean, the blood doesn't seem to leave. Uh, examine the blood more carefully. Is it mad? Oh, boy. She doesn't help me, though, right now. Yeah. I don't know why it's giving me that, but... Cool. I'm going crazy. Oh no, Jesse the good. Roll again. We gotta get this, buddy. We gotta get this. Okay, 17. All right, okay. There is no magic binding this blood to your body. Only guilt. You shake your head, and it seems to go away. Only then. 
If you're not Lady fortunate, Macbeth. no soul will be able to know you were behind this murder. You wonder if your misdeed will be noticed. We're gonna leave her body? Wait, what? The urge update. Oh shit. This feels like I've lost something. Ah. Change. Oh. This is some sloppy work. You talk. Deception? Oh no. Oh no. I think I must have killed her. F5. That much is obvious, but why? Uh I I can't remember. I don't know the why of it. The work of the parasite, I shouldn't wonder. <sighs> the worm in your head has never slept more peacefully. You know in your heart it was something... <laughs> Why would he smile like that? Hungrier. Uh... We can but stand guard against the parasite. I'll be watching. An uneasy feeling lingers in the air. As the Inquisition departs, you are left alone with a familiar headache. Mm. I make this vow. I will gain control. I will save the next innocent. Every one of your instincts screams against the saccharine thought. You feel close to fainting again. Spasm grips your chest. What? Your strength falters. An emptiness grows within you, Paladin. Something has been lost. You have broken your oath, Paladin. At the close of day, I will be waiting for you. We have much to discuss. Oh, shit. Is there absolutely no way to prevent that? Holy shit. Is there no way to prevent this? All right, we will F5 right here. This is a save just to be safe. Is there no way to prevent this? gotta be a way there's got i gotta defeat the dark urge i gotta defeat it i have to do this i have to figure this out this was my destiny i don't like this i'm gonna figure this out. i'm gonna figure out a way to beat it i'm gonna beat you dark urge i'm gonna beat you i'm gonna beat you destiny is only what we make of it please oh please uh, yeah, you can stay. <laughs> then, well, joking aside. Okay. Need to find a way forward. What can we do? What can we do? Can I sleep you? Can I... What are my options? What are my options? Jump. Push, dip, shove, hide, throw, dash, disengage. 
Maiming Strike, Weakness, Piercing. to you paladin common passives toggle non-lethal attacks wouldn't that just make her more vulnerable to being murdered oh my god what are my options here i wonder if i could like make her invisible like, what if I make her invisible? <coughs> Do I even have a scroll? False life? What if I give her more hit points? I don't have an option, do I? I told her to leave and she straight up was killed anyway. Yo, I gotta save her. I gotta save her life. How am I gonna do this? Okay, what if I non-lethally attack her? She's back. Well, shit. Nope, she dies no matter what. There's nothing I can do for this girl. Hold on. What if I non-lethally... Go run away! Get out of here! Go! Get out of here! Go! I can't smite her. Get out of here! Go! I'm trying to save your life! Stop coming back! Stop coming back! God damn you! I'm trying to save you! Yeah, all right. She's dead. So I lost my oath. Yo, okay. This is wild. All right. Yeah. <coughs> okay. So I failed my oath, which I figured was going to happen. And I killed a girl, which I didn't think was going to happen. I definitely didn't think that was going to occur. So here we are. Wow. All right. Well, I gave it. A, I gave it the old once over. Hold on. Can I?
The corpse regards you lifelessly. With Liala, but... Interesting though that she didn't wasn't like you killed me, bro. Cause did I realize? Did, realize? Did I realize? Okay. Very well. well. Oh shit. Hey, pal. Sup? Sounds like a good moment to talk. I have been waiting for you. I felt the moment of your liberation, the shedding of your bond. You called to me. I am here to show you the way. Who are you? I was the first. The first to swear. The first oh, to fall. Shit. When another's oath is broken, I stand witness. I hear their sorrow. I see their jubilation. I guide their hand. Oathbreaker. You swore this is kind of fun. All right. Defenseless. To stand as an emblem for all that is good and just in this world. Tell me. Why did you abandon your oath? Uh, and cruelty within. Uh, it was not my intention. My actions had unexpected consequences. I no longer believe in the teachings. I owe you no- no. I am a poor paladin. My mind is shattered and cruelty is within. Cruelty need not conflict with purpose. And a shattered mind may yet uphold an oath. But you have fallen. And it seems you do not fully comprehend the reason why. Take comfort in your undoing. I, like you, abandoned my cause. But much can still be achieved. Your oath is broken. The light within you fades. A new power is What awakening. does this mean, dude? What does this mean? Isn't there a way to reclaim my oath? It is possible. But such a promise must not be made lightly. Wealth must be sacrificed. And your soul re-pledged. It is wise to first consider what is gained. And what is lost in the bargain? Should you wish to do so, speak with me again. And what are the powers? Darkness will obey your summons. The dead will march to your rhythm. Even now, these shadows gather around you. They sense the cracks in your armor. They yearn to be used, to be inflicted. I want to remain pure. I want to, he's Jesse the Good. Jesse the Good would want to remain pure. I served a noble lord. I fought for him without question or restraint. Where his light shone, my sword followed. In his name, I raised villages, put thousands to the sword. I believed our greater purpose required such brutality, such sacrifice. But his light was so radiant, it blinded me to all else. 
I could not see the darkness and corruption of the path he led me down. When I finally saw the truth, he would not be reasoned with. So, I ended him. For this, I was called Oathbreaker. It can't have been easy. It was merely a choice, as I have made countless others since. What's past is past. We are here to discuss your future. I wielded the powers of darkness, yet held a candle for those who needed the light. My actions followed no teaching, apart from my own justification. Good or ill, I made my choices. Eventually, I heard the call of others who had strayed. I showed them the way, as I show you now. Damn. I can't figure out whether Jesse the Good would be so ashamed of the murder he just committed that he'd be like, you're right, I am an Oathbreaker. Or he would be like, no, I'm pure. Should we, should, should we, should we, you know what? Roll your dice IRL. My dice IRL, where is, where is my dice? Hold on, I'll go to, I'll go to a random dice number machine. Uh, roll dice. Perfect. Uh, D6. Uh, not a D4. Nope. Okay, that's, that's bad. I can't believe this exists on Google. That's crazy. Okay. If it's a three or if it's a one to three, I will go Oathbreaker. If it's a four, five, or six, I will stay pure. <laughs> Hold on. How do I show you this? How do I show you this? This sucks. This, I... How is that even... How is that even fair? How is that even fair? Even on Google, I roll a one. Do not resist. Surrender and be remade. Though born of a vile source, these powers can be used for good or ill. Your oath no longer binds you. The choice is yours alone. Oh shit, what? What? Wait, what? So I have spiteful suffering, control on dead, dreadful as uh, aspect. What? Frightened nearby enemies? What? Hellish rebuke? What? What is happening right now? What? Am I gonna have to re-level? Am I gonna have to re-level? 
All right, hold on. I need, I need, I need a, hold on. I need a minute. I need a minute. I need a drink. Oh my God. Oh my God. Let's, uh, let's figure some shit out. So I have Wrathful Smite. Uh huh. Heroism. Command. So I lost. Alright, Wrathful Smite it is. Possibly frightens your target. Shield of Faith, Bless. Cure Wounds, Searing Smite. Yeah, we'll keep what I have. Yo, this is absolutely... Uh, let's get rid of Command and instead pick... That's crazy, dude. What? <laughs> well, I now have a lot of class actions that are like, you crazy now. All right, I mean. Oathbreaker, what do you need of me? Um, what happens if I reclaim my oath? Returning to your oath means relinquishing the darkness within you. Its evil must be banished. Your oath-sworn powers will return. You will be bound again by the decrees you promised to uphold. Huh. Yeah, I can't... I mean, I can't do that. As long as I know that I'm out here killing people. Shit. Well... The legend of Jesse the Good continues, and I don't know what... I mean, okay... Okay, back again. Oh, hey, hi. What's she gonna say? Is she gonna be like, bro? I thought this camp was supposed to be our safe haven. Not quite so when we wake up to dead tiefling bards. I may have difficulty sleeping for a while. Hmm. I wasn't responsible. So, you're not in full control of your faculties. If you think it might happen again, Warn me. I would hate to have to kill you. Okay. I almost feel bad. Like, if I wasn't terrified this was D&D, &D, my character would be like, I must travel alone. I need you all to remain at camp. Got this area here. Hump down Carlac. It really wants me to do that. Okay. Stressing now. I bet if I was playing a character who was like just an evil dude, this would be less stressful. But now I'm terrified I'm just gonna kill all my friends. Let's have a look. It's 
something tore right through these people. They didn't stand a chance. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on. <clears throat> we gotta jump back. Yo, I'm just trying to keep the weight down. Where did it go? Nope, 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 nope. Prone? Son of a biscuit. Look, sure, the dark urge might get the dog. That's curious. But also, not a chance. I'll fit in there. What the shit? Oh, hold on. You have my attention. Yeah. Um. Well, oh, shit. I feel like this is gonna lead me un. Well, I don't know what this is gonna lead me to. All right, Gail, you know what to do. You know what to do. <laughs> what to do. She took a few goblins with her, at least. A brave effort. Oh, it's the owl. Oh, no! Did she die? <gasps> they killed her, and that's why I have the cub. Oh, no! Oh, no! I am going to take off Knock and put on Misty Step. Oh, that's heartbreaking. Okay. All right. Um. Can I misty step down? This will come in handy. An owl bear egg. These are supposed to be worth a fortune. Oak Father's Embrace? Take all. Holy moly. <clears throat> I try to speak with dead, but you can't speak with beasts, as I've learned. Oh, it's the spear that was in her. Oh, that's so sad. Uh, it'll be under the quest, right? First off. Um, supply sack. Open. Move egg to here. <laughs> camp supplies? No! Not camp supplies! Oh, that's so messed up. Target must be a playable character. Ouch. Huh. Wow. Okay. Well, that sucks. Curiosity must be satisfied. Oh. May it please, Mistra. Uh, 
Well, that explains a lot about that. Okay, um, let's step back up here. Hey gang, He's bad here. bad news. Uh, tr that's not a gale-sized hole. Gale. Oh my whole god. Gale, no, Gale. N oh, I guess you can climb down. Okay, never mind. You're smarter than me, Gale. That's why you wear the cowboy hat. Let's move. Never wanted the easy path. Hey, pupper, what's going on over here? Keep moving, stranger. Quietly. I told you to go. Um, persuade. Calm yourself. I only harm those deserving of it. Oh no. I need all the bonuses. I'll take that nat 20. Let's go. We're good friends now, you and me. There's death in your scent, but not in your words. Still, you should go. My friend is injured. He needs rest. Mm. Of course he will. And then we'll return home. Oh, pupper. Mm. What happened to your friend exactly? We were attacked. We're cackling furry things on two legs. And their smell, it was strange, rotten, evil. You know the creatures he describes. Gnolls. He calls me Scratch. You can do the same. No, I won't leave him. If it comes to that, I may. Thank you. I'm not gonna loot him. I don't want to piss off my new best friend. Look, even the dark urge isn't gonna kill a dog. Okay, it's not. Dark urge won't do that to me. Dark urge ain't a piece of shit. Take this fishing rod and go fish with the fishing rod? Time out. What's the rules here? Did Crendor find this spot? Nope. I already have one of those. <coughs> okay. can't go in the water. I could jump over to there, but that's not particularly helpful unless I can jump. Keep jumping. Once Fairy bush! Here. That's helpful. Alright, come on, team. 
I've lost my way. I love you, pal. You'll be okay, buddy. Alright, well, this sucks. But I hope you find your way to my camp. I hope I don't kill you. <laughs> mm, actually, what am I doing? Let's just go back. That was... I'm a double hit with emotions so far. Okay. Alright. Nothing a little LaCroix can't fix. Okay, Knowles. We gotta kill every last one of these motherfuckers. Every last one of them. F these dudes right in their stupid... Oh, I can talk to the hyenas, though. Maybe. Hey, fellas. What's, What's up? Discussion. The creature's eyes roll back in its head. <coughs> equal parts bliss and agony. Her awful smell irresistible. And while her blood feast has filled her, the hyena is not yet sated. Come! See! My flesh becomes new flesh! You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones. And a what? yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. What? You engrave her pained mules upon your heart. Her back arches impossibly. A grace made possible only by it being broken. Uh... Yes, come closer. Feed the new flesh. Her belly splits like a rotten fruit, birthing a frenzy of claws and fangs. Nah. <laughs> nah, F this son of a bitch. You hurt my good boy. You land a swift strike against her skull. She yelps, <laughs> then goes still. Uh, what about that bloody beast over Whatever there? The horrific creature was growing inside the hyena. Dies along with her. Oh, uh, oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. Almut. Uh. I can are you kidding me with the one HP <coughs> oh boy um I'm good where is are you not in combat lady what's going on with you What did I do? What? 
Uh, what? Am I bugged? Hell of a bug. Okay. Hey. Hi. Hello. Hamstring on this dude, please. Nice. And then, uh, yeah, enter. So they're just bloated and wounded, and I am going to kill this guy. And I'm gonna keep moving. Are you kidding me right now? How much do you have left? Five? Take him out. He was gonna go report me to others. Swift and lethal. Let my name be known. Dead. All right, and turn. Oh, okay, that's no good. But hey, I got most of them. Okay, I gotta kill all the gnolls from my pupper. This is about vengeance. Ooh, and a hyena ear. Bro, what? Shipment orders. Read. Deliver the chest to me unopened. Read the first sentence again. Open it and I will know because you will be dead. This is not a threat. This is what happened if you open the chest. Okay. Uh, yep. Yup. Send to camp. Send to camp. Pick up. Light crossbows, whatever. The goodly folk. The gate is closed. As per my last letter. Read. Your analysis is flawed. The hells are not so simple to understand, boiling down nine cosmological layers into evil. But with a few more rules, does generations of scholars discredit? Each layer is its own unique moral and magical ecosystem. What Zeriel permits in Avernus may be blasphemy to Mammon in the chain cities of Mineros. Right. Okay. Knowledge! Also F5. Yo, the, 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 the auto saves do not auto save you. That's a fact in this game. My feet can carry it me. is not. Auto saves are like, ha ha ha, bitch. So is the assumption here that this Noel opened the chest? Or did he just get got? Because I don't see a chest to open. That's further along over here. Mm, my ear itches. Uh, pumpkin. Carnival squash. Red apple. Red apple. Carnival squash. 
Carrot. Pumpkin. 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 Cabbage. What's hiding here? Gonna real quickly alchemize. Oh, okay, that's a thing I unlocked, I guess. Oh shit. What the hell is this? What the hell is this? Okay, I don't see. I'm gonna keep looking. Pretty good, to be honest. No traps, please. That viscera had too much money for viscera. Okay. Mm. We got malt. We got four gnolls up here, and I do want to kill the gnolls because not sure if you're aware, but f them. They hurt my boy. Okay, so we're gonna just. I don't need any attention right now. Shift C. What path lies before me? They're right. Twenty, twenty, twenty-two, huh? No fang of Yinugu. Cool, F that guy. Get me up, would you? That stupid fang. Well, hello. <laughs> Battle commence, dum dum. Yeah, I'm aware enemies have sight lines. Yeah, that's a miss, all right. Oh, he's dashing, he's dashing, he's dashing. Oh, he got that fury. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. And he's trying to get high ground? Get out of town. Okay, ow. He's dashing, he's dashing. Whoa, what the shit was that? Um, I can use an item, right? I would like to use... Fine, we are going to just simply uh Can I get up here? Hell yeah, haters. I will ascend. <coughs> okay. Works. And because I want to, let's do it again. <laughs> Dead, you big idiot. And move here. Sometimes the only way out is through. All right, and I'm gonna go here. To find a way forward. And I'm going to bless you, you, 
and you. Not safer to And then I'm going to uh Enter. Oh hey, mister. How you doing? Bop! Critical miss! You are Shadowheart? God damn it. I don't want to say you're worthless. You're not worthless. You're not worthless. I love you. You're all great. But Shadowheart, you just can't hit anyone to save your life. You, you dumb idiot. Okay. And victory awaits. I will not know failure. Skidoosh! Nice. No choice but to keep going. What path lies before me? Uh, can I hit you with this? Not enough movement. I can hit this guy though. What? I can't give her shit if you're shit too, man! Cool, good. I mean, at least they're stupid. Let's light them up. Look at us, solving problems, killing gnolls, taking ears. Suddenly playing Diablo and really weirded out by it. Open up. Yes, yes. With All right. Haste. Not too shabby. Uh, Mangled Corpse, I don't need to talk to you. Unless... On oppression and peacocks. Written in a furious, slopping hand, this letter to the editor of the Baldur's Bash. Dear editor, I find it despicable, nay diabolical, that you would defend Baldur's Gate's ridiculous restrictions regarding animals in the city. No animal larger than a peacock may gain entry? How archaic! My darling Giselle is the most well behaved bear you'll ever meet. And yet, you uh, to spend time with my child, I must visit my summer home in Comir. Cormir. I call upon Parliament of Peers to resolve this issue immediately. The emotional and psychological well-being of the people of Baldur's Gate is at stake. And I shall take this to the highest authority, should it not be dealt with accordingly. Right now, Giselle cries out for her father. This archaic policy. Mr. R. Pickens. What's inside? What is in this rib cage? Whole bunch of nothing. Bones and viscera, bones and viscera. Okay, well, this was a direction that we went. Now we're going to go here. Can I pick up the wheelbarrow? Guard like wheelbarrows. What of it? Oh, I'm sorry. Is there just a home here? God damn it. What is this? There is so much in this game. Wish I had a bag of holding. Hey, hmm. girl, how you even doing? Take your you Take your you what am I what am I doing? Oh. Oh. That was I a waste it. spot. And what is this way? Holy moly, what the ding dongs? Alright, we're going away from where my quest was. We'll come back. Don't worry. Don't waste a step. Oh, 
that will fit in my pack. Hey, thanks to the true West. No, this isn't Final Fantasy. Uh oh, what the shit? We found the remains of a caravan, and a note in the corpse mentioned a valuable chest in someone named NF. Perhaps someone survived this attack. Oh, NF. So if I go over here, I want to bring Will with me. I'll do that. But this is something entirely different, I think. Well, shit. Walked into that, I guess. Okay, someone's being held off for the time being. Oh no, what if we go this way and kill the warlord? Okay. okay. Thank God there was a save at the beginning, because I definitely could do this better. Hellish Rebuke, bitch! Ooh! Well, 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 look at us now. Hear that? Someone's fighting the gnolls. We should help. Don't be a fool, lad. Shut your mouth and keep your head down. Leave a few rocks to them that don't value their own skin. <laughs> Okay. All right. Well. Succumbed? What does that mean exactly? Can I... Save him? What does that mean? Succumbed for two turns? Can't take bonus actions or reactions. Cool. That's not something I can probably need to spell. Holy shit. Alright, lady. You're gonna we're coming over. Alright, lady, we're coming over here for this. You get you get this shit. Uh I really could have used that. I really could have used that hit. I don't fancy their chances. May it please, Miss Trump. Eat this. Yeah, all right. I won't give in.
Yeah! You little bitch. Taking your friend's ear right in front of you. How's that? How's that shit? Okay. Sword, I need you to F a dude up. Nice. Okay, and then come over here. Nice. Go magic sword. With a shock of psychic pain, the pack leader's mind clamps onto yours. You see yourself through her eyes, a pulsing red cluster of organs. <coughs> oh, shit. Feast. No. The voice has forbidden this meat. Noll see your whole world as a meal. This voice is acting as a leash, but it won't hold them for long. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. What? Authority. What? Uh, yeah. A memory. The beast daubs the symbol of the absolute on a cave wall in blood. Very deep. A tadpole struggles to assert control against the ravenous chaos of her mind. Interesting. Devour the other gnolls. Oh my god. What? You see drow and goblins restraining her, her mind player reaching out. And then the voice bringing order. Eating this meat was forbidden, but it would lead her to a feast. I don't want to use the tadpoles. Oh, hmm. Although I tried to once, I think, way back when and failed. No. No. Paralyzed. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool. <laughs> JC is the coolest dude who ever lived. This man cannot be stopped. How is no one? What are you doing? Are you not? She's too busy focusing on not being helpful. Go here. Or we just pray something happens. Ignis. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna go here real quick. Back away a little bit more. Concentrate. <clears throat> okay, you need to do literally anything. Okay, that works. Uh, and then you need to come Move here it. and then just like give him the old face that way. Okay. Can't even catch my breath. Just to be safe. That guy died. This dude is a pain in the ass. This guy is like. Uh... Hi, how are you? 
don't happen to have any... You're stupid as shit. Cut it out, cut it out, cut it out. Stop. Um. Seriously with the miss? I'm going to do this, and then I am going to back the oh shit God. away. Well, so much for peace. <sighs> okay, this guy hits like a fucking truck. That was a good ass hit. Okay. Frightened. That's not helpful. I'll take those critical misses. Come on. <coughs> Gale. Gale. Okay. All right. This guy's still a pain in my ass. Uh, you, sweet sweet princess, need to. This dude even have anything? Yeah, I can't tell. Is that a flail? Yeah, it is. All right. <laughs> weapon dropped. But no, weapon not dropped. Need to stay focused. Oh, okay. Time to move back. Time to push my luck again. Um. <coughs> All right, we're just gonna sit tight. Of movement? Oh, okay. Alright, you potentially die. Keep being frightened. That's good. Paralyzed. Aye. 
Come on, you stupid gnolls. Shit, I keep forgetting about this the mechanics of D&D. I keep forgetting that D&D exists and it's a thing that Make people way. like and enjoy. Fuck, fuck this shit. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. All right, cool. Well, that's a travesty. <gasps> no, I'm not going to use the frog power. F them frogs. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Every, every single D... I'm going to say, I'm going to say the truth. Every single DM involved with the crafting of this game, pretty sure... Assholes. Every last one of them. Big assholes. At the ready. All right. Oh, that's cool. We got like a uh, a pouch with a loot. And no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna take her shit. Just leave it there. As a reminder, that shit be weird and not at all cool. Matt Mercer isn't an asshole? I don't know. Did he design those knolls? Because that seems like an asshole thing to me. Chase the thoughts of that poor girl you killed from your head. You wonder what she looked like as she died. Squirming, skewered in abject agony. barely complies you feel such rushes from your thoughts of the dead woman why did she die the mystery gnaws at your pounding heart me lord jubilant day i have found your vile self at last it has fell your loyal and ever adoring butler I followed you, my dear rotted master. We have been parted so tragically long. <laughs> what the? No, oh, one hell of a butler the most unprincipled servant you could hope for you have always uh, struggled to conduct yourself properly without me i found you following the stench of that bard <sighs> she reeked across the coast like a piece of dog mark on the road
such fine work could never be done by a wretch like me. Anyways, I come once again bearing a part of your dreadful inheritance. I just took it? You earned this iniquitous prize through your great show of exceptional violence the other night. I'm sure Master will be better soon. A fellow of your fine breeding is never down for long. <laughs> I cannot wait until your next act of shameless barbarity. <coughs> there will be no more barbarity. Death wants everything to do with you, good villain. Be true to yourself, my lord. Oh my god. This game will not let a man fight his urge. I'm fighting it. I refuse to give up. I'm going to get to the finish line and I'll be a good man. The Deathstalker mantle? What the shit? Visible for two turns. I'm not wearing it. I'm not wearing it. <gasps> oh, good boy. Oh, no. I lost the ability to talk to animals. <coughs> oh, no. What do I do here? Should speak up. Oh, oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. I'm sorry. You're welcome here. We love you, and I'm not a bad person. You're a good boy, Scratch. You're a good boy, and I'm not a terrible human. Um, where's Dark Card at? Hey, hi. Shadowheart? Hi. Yeah. May hey. the darkness protect you. Right, sure, 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 sure. Uh, Ain't I'm gonna sure. leave your ass. Fine. I'll be here. Well met. Um. That's the spirit. Level up. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Oh boy. All right. We got cantrips. Bone chill friends. Mage hand poison spray true strike. <clears throat> uh That's kind of interesting. Prevent the target from healing. Cloud of Daggers! Attack anyone inside. That could be interesting. Thrall. Mirror image, Misty Step. So he would have Misty Step too. He's just warlocking it up, basically. Hex. Hex is always good. Hex is fun. Do I not have Hex? Did I just never get Hex? Are you serious? I kind of want to 
want Hex. But a cloud of daggers is pretty effing cool. Replace spells. Change out. Hellish Rebuke. <coughs> Any creature that hits you. Shatter. I do love shatter. Alright. Confirm. These are all my other ones, huh? Alright. A feat. Approvability, eh? Where are we at right now? Charisma and... Intellect? We'll just bump my AC too. This man has a whole bunch of nothing on his body. What can I give him? What can I give you from my collection of insanity? Split. Confirm. Okay. And then you have bone chill or you can maybe learn it. Speak with dead. Maybe you can use that. Ah, can you use this sword? More importantly, can you use this? Blazer of Benevolence. Padded armor, light armor. What is this? Light armor. Bardic Inspiration. That doesn't fucking help you. Dagger? Let's figure out what your vibe is, my man. Ray of Sickness. I don't know what you can use or what you can't use, so I'm just going to start tossing stuff your way. Let's see where we end up. That salami is absolutely hilarious. <laughs> Haste Helm, rare. The warrior gains momentum for three turns. I don't know what I'm doing with that. But, let's go. Man, can you learn these? Nope. Nope. This is not a thing you can do. Alright, well. Send a gale. Alright. What's your vibe with this weapon? Nope, you don't have proficiency. What's your vibe with the dagger? You can use daggers. That's a 310. This is a 47. Never mind, y'all. Send back to Jesse the Good. I feel like I saw a rapier or something elsewhere. I'll bring you with. We'll see what the hell happens. Uh, leave camp. It was a time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. Now, a mere werebear could swat me halfway to arm. Strange things are happening to us. What festers in our minds may well impel our bodies. Okay. What if we all crouch? A knife in the dark. Switch up to you. The pro. Quiet as a
Welcome to the party, pal! Two steps at a time. Yo, that shit is flat busted. Oh my god. What? What? Do a quick save. That's an amazing ability. Oh my god, they can't even come this way unless these two are idiots and they do. In which case, please do. What the hell is this? One jump down from a ball and just another one? Okay. You should run this way. Nope. But can I do that again? But can I do it here? Stop. Oh my god, was that a one? This thing is, oh my, he's running through it, you big idiot! Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop this madness. Yo, I don't even know Shadowheart. I don't even know her. She ain't nothing to me no more. I don't even know that woman. I don't even know or care about her. She ain't nothing. I tried to keep her around because I got her stupid trinket and I figured maybe that would help. I don't even need her. The trinket belongs to me now. She sucks. She's a big, she's a big stupid idiot. I don't even know that woman. I don't even know who the hell that is. Shadow who? Shadow what? Hellish rebuke, bitch. I don't even know how to react. What did he do? He ate his friend? No, he does. Oh my god. Cut it out, man. Um... Are my friends not in Nothing combat? Important is ever easy. What is happening? Are they not in the turn order? On the victor's path. Suck. Uh, I wonder if this is worth the cost. <coughs> okay, so I'm just standing in poison. Is that my life now? Well, guess what? Raffle smite, bitch! Oh, okay. I guess we're. I guess we're cool. You must be so pissed. You must be the most pissed. Well, get pissed on this big idiot. That weapon drop, weapon pickup is so silly, but also. Hellish rebuke, bitch! Woo! <laughs> Where are you going? Alright, well, you know what? It's about time I missed. But also, from downtown. Nothing will stand in my way. Yo, I don't even know this lady. I don't even know who Shadowheart who? You should take a look. Shadow who? Shadowheart what? I don't know that woman. Oh my god, she's trash. She's a poo-poo character from Poo-Poo Town. I don't even know her. Shadow who? 
Shadow Poo Poo. That's who. So who heals? I heal. Damn it. Uh, what? Oh, what's her face? Wanted a specimen. Yo, pick up. This one is a true soul <coughs> parasite. It can enhance you. No. You can absorb its potential. No. Open your mind to it. No. You already know how. No. 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 Uh, remind me. Remind me when we're done trying to be a good guy to do the literal evilest run ever. Like an ultra hell run where I'm just the worst guy ever. You are not ready. That's all right. Remind me to be to the worst man who ever lived in the future. Rather than later. Jesse the Evil? Yeah, we're going to do a Jesse the Evil run for sure. What the shit is this? Shattered Flail, rare bludgeoning, get out of town. Whoa, pick up. Um, sweet, sweet, sassy molassy. 7 to 12, is that better than this? <gasps> Am I just rolling with a bone weapon now? Stop. But they go mad if they don't continue hitting the weapon each turn. Hitting the enemy each turn? Ooh, I can't promise that. Okay. That's fun, though. That's fun. Okay, shit. Huh, all right. Mm. Breathe deep and move. Something good here, I hope. Nope, just ears. By the gods. Oh, hi. You're a hi. sweet sight. Are any of my crew still alive out there? Oh, no, it's a grim sight. This whole journey's been one grim sight after another. Knolls, goblins, drow. Risen Road's more dangerous than ever. You're the first friendly face we've seen since Eltergard. Mm. Eltergard's a long way from here. Where are you headed? We're bound for Baldur's Gate. Got some cargo to deliver. But we've a stop to make along the way. Mm. Where's that? Joaquin's Rest. It's just up the road. I'd be enjoying a mug of ale right now if those beasts hadn't jumped us. Listen, you look like you know how to handle yourself. You should meet my associates. We've got our own drinking spot by the tavern. Invitation only. Tell the fellow on the door. Little serpent, long shadow. He'll take good care of you. Um... What's in the chest? Your cargo? Aye. The whole reason we're in this mess. Trinkets for some rich tosser in Baldur's Gate. He gets his shiny baubles. We get a handful of Tarenths. Tarenths are the currency of the Zentarim. A network of merchants and mercenaries with few scruples. Oh. Uh... Whatever your cargo is, I'll take it as payment. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, your Zent. I'd wage on more than just your crew had to die over these bubbles. Hmm. Oh, but I don't have fueled by the... I don't have any bonus? No bonus? <laughs> shit, here we go. You know, as they say, I am, in fact, an Oathbreaker, so. Listen, 
I'm indebted to you. And that's why I'm giving you a chance to walk away before you get yourself killed. You made short work of the Knolls. Reckon you'd make shorter work of me and the boy. But we're not merchants. We're Zahentarim agents. Steal from us and you'll have a price on your head. Uh -uh. Curious. If there are valuable goods on the move, the Black Company's always involved. We're the grease that keeps the wheels of commerce turning. And we don't take kindly to people who meddle in our business. This is the point when a clever lad like you accepts my gratitude and walks away. I swore in the black hand, it's not worth dying for. Give me the cargo. Oh, shit! <laughs> Oathbreaker, bitch! Fine. No need for more violence. I'll tell my associates everything was lost in the ambush. The chest's all yours. Damn thing's still <coughs> tighter than a duke's purse strings. So there's no point in trying to open it. And no hard feelings, you hear? I'd have done the same if I were you. Business at the end of a blade is still business. Ruthless bastard like you could make a name for yourself in the Zentarim. Make sure to drop by our hideout. Okay. Okay. Look at that, see? Speedy reply. Bro, what? Uh, send a will. Hold on, did I just... What is this? What do you mean, not prefer- It's just... I'm, I'm letting you keep this because I think that would be really cool if you could use that. I'm going to get you martial weapons. Are you kidding me? That's so cool looking. All right. Uh, Son of Jesse the Good. We'll be back. We'll be back. Two steps at a time. That symbol in the blood. What does it mean? I've got so many freaking null ears. Still breathing. Just despite alive. everything. That's lucky. Laser, you've the most exquisite eyes. Golden as the sands of the cap. And you have a soft skull. A gay tentacle will have no issues pushing through it. Is that a compliment? That's curious. So that's the strong box. Um, Moving in. <clears throat> We're a long way from Waterdeep. Find the missing shipment. Complete, right? Complete. Find the missing shipment. We did find it. Because it's ours now. Okay. Still alive. So that's progress. Iron flask. Glowing flask. Well, lad. It's our lucky day after all. I don't feel lucky. The rest of our crew's half digested, and you're still alive. What the hell is the iron flask? Is it just for selling? The 
just gonna press save. What does it do? Examine. with a grinning face this cold iron flask is sealed with a brass stopper investigate come on don't be stupid I don't get it the uh, roll again please don't be stupid okay Lucky number 13, that should be fine. Disguised among the decorative elements, you notice a familiar arcane engraving. <coughs> this is a powerful magical item, capable of trapping and holding a creature. The sealed stopper suggests it is inhabited. Uh... I saved. What if I... Can I open it? I can throw it at someone. Interesting. Okay, so right now... I have... The ability to... <laughs> when I fight the goblins, I have the horn... And, oh, it's already there. And I have this. I can inspect it again. The flask is cold and heavy in your hand. Remove the stuff. Oh, my God. It's going to be like a... Uh... The flask shudders in your hand. Then magical energy emanates from its neck as a creature emerges. Just gonna reload real quick. 